about to leave Already packing Come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away To a place where we don't know About to see The world in action What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for made it to Seattle we the flight was was good Matthew got held up in uh, immigration forever so we, we landed at 12 we just made it to the city now at 3 I am so tired we're just gonna shower get freshened up and then head out to explore the city a little bit. It is a beautiful day. So, let's see what Seattle has in store. So we made it, we made it to Seattle. We're, uh, we, got, we got to the hotel, had a shower. Uh, freshened, up. freshened up. First stop, obviously Starbucks. Now we're just, needed, definitely. <laughs> now we're just here having a walk around. Uh, sat by the Museum of Pop Culture, is it? Yes. And the Space Needle. Space Needle. Now we're going to take a walk down to Pike Place Market. Check out all that fuss is about. <laughs> Probably grab something to eat. day one the flight it's quarter to nine <laughs> almost <laughs> bedtime as normal yep. um so after we went to pike place we wandered around a little for nine months of preparation we had absolutely no idea where we were going <laughs> where we wanted to eat or anything but we ended up at a proper like American authentic diner. yeah dive bar Beers and burgers, order of the day, done. Then we came back to the hotel, grabbed a jumper and went up to the little rooftop terrace um, where they have, like, well, they have sofas and fire pits and stuff, but fire pits sadly out of action today. Um, but sunset was gorgeous, so we could see through the um, Space Needle. Yep. Uh, so we watched the sun go down behind the mountains. There's a little cute dog up there. And then we came back to the room. We're going to do some better research for tomorrow. Yeah. And we are going to succumb to jet lag and get ready for another big day tomorrow. Yep. Yeah. Uh, 10 o'clock is probably going to be my, uh, my limit, I think. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm going to be asleep. Um, yeah, day one in the books. Job done. Job done. Morning, day two in Seattle. Uh, the jet lag was very real last night. Mister, oh, I don't suffer from jet lag. Should we set an alarm for breakfast? Woke me up at 3.30 a.m. <laughs> Brian Breezy. Um, so, man, luckily I managed to get a bit more sleep back to, back to about 5.30, but it's gonna be a long day today. Um, gonna get breakfast now, and then we're gonna go up to uh, Fremont 
and see the troll and then round to Capitol Hill. Yes we are, Capitol Hill looks awesome, lots of Instagram spots so hopefully it should be a fun day. Fremont Troll uh, after walking around the whole of what's the lake? Lake Union. It's 9.30. <laughs> We've already walked about four miles this morning. Yeah, I've done 10,000 steps already. I feel like it's like 5 pm. <laughs> I'm ready for dinner. <laughs> um, now we're going to go check out the Stops Park, the gas, uh, gas Lake Stops Park, um, and then do some more walking, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Washington. We had a little bit of a false start and didn't come to the campus. Main right part away. of the campus. <laughs> yeah, hey, you can pack me up. But then we found the right part and it's so gorgeous. I cannot even. We sat on the quad, pretended we're not way too old to be students. And then we're just taking a little wander around. Yeah, to uh, Capitol Hill. Capitol, Capitol Hill, yeah. For that. Yep. finished eating one of the biggest ice creams I've ever had of my life uh, at Molly Moons. Uh, I think the plan is to go to the hotel next, yeah. uh, regroup after our early start, uh, maybe change into some shorts because it's scorching. Find somewhere to go for dinner. We'll go there. We'll go there. <laughs> Say that, it's like 3pm or something. Yeah, not got quite, a few hours. Not quite dinner time. Uh, we're just watching some baseball training, some guys throwing around football, feeling super American. 